Yo, yeah, what's good, my people? I go by the name T Classic, aka Classical Boy, aka Serimaka Watch, Serimaka Booty. And you're watching Ebony Live TV. Don't go anywhere. Stay tuned. <laughs> I would say, um, Fall in Love featuring me or cool. Because that song was just everything. It was everything. It's, I would say it's, it was the one that brought me you know, to the limelight. And, Thanks for that, and thanks to Miyoko. Man, at first, I was nervous because I've had a lot of things about Miyoko, like, oh, the guy is proud, he doesn't pick calls, blah, 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 like that. So I was like, oh, let me just try my best, let me just try my luck. Just now. So I just contacted um, um, Marco, that's the MW person, though, and you know, he hooked us up. And we sent the song to him around 11, a.m. in the morning and around 2 p.m. in the, like in the afternoon, send it back. I was shocked, like, wow, really? And since then, he has been supporting me, you know. Miyoko is energetic, you know, it's just, it's just a vibe, man, it's a vibe. Thanks to Miyoko, man. <laughs> Nobody Find Past You was a song I recorded on my birthday and, you know, I recorded it at first, I didn't like the song, and my CEO was like, no, this is a jam, you just have to, you know, Let's just put it out there. Because after the um, release of Fall in Love with Mayor Kuhn, I, I would say pressure was on me. You know, people were like, oh, Fall in Love with because of Mayor Kuhn. So let us see what he can do without nobody on this song. So I just like, okay, I just, you know, recorded the song and we put it online and people loved it. And since then, it's a life story change. It, like, it, my story just changed actually and it has close to like 5 million views on YouTube right now and it's wow for me, it's wow for me. So thanks to the fans, thanks to the OAP, to the DJs, you know, supporting the brand Team T Classic, God bless. So think about it, you know, <clears throat> uh, uh, we dropped Nobody Fine Pass You and you know, people wanted more music from Classical Boy, people wanted more tune, you know, so I just decided to, you know, sing a song about um, my relationship back then, like four years ago, and I just like, you know, talk about it now. And the concept was about a girl cheating on me, and um, we both cheated, actually, so, and we just have to start the thing over and over again. So I just sing about that, Sha. And before you know it, it's doing well to close to 100 k views on YouTube, man. I'm blessed, I'm blessed. I'm grateful, actually, I'm grateful. The video, the concept, um, I would say the director, Naya, was the brain boss behind those stuff and um, my CEO, you know, because I like to, you know, like dance like Michael Jackson when I was a kid. So my CEO was like, why not do something in the video? You know, why not dance, why not do something? It's not like I dance like that, like that, but actually I still give some moves, you know, some little move works on. Oh, oh, you understand so and it was a great concept man it was a great concept and big shout, big shout out to um naya big shout out to darcy god bless yeah i just drop um think about it i just want to you know focus on you know promoting think about it for now and next year i'll be dropping ep that will be around march uh april i'll be dropping an ep and um probably an album to like the rest of the year 2020 so just watch out for the boy watch out uh i would say yeah we, we we put a lot of work into my brand and you know with the help of my team and um more 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 it was we went i will not say i wasn't expecting this much i wasn't expecting, i was even still thinking probably oh next year 2020 something will be like but well, trust me, we just dropped a couple of songs and everything just went wow. Everything just boom for me and I was shocked. It was beyond my expectation. So I would say, yeah, I wasn't expecting that. I would like to collaborate with um, um, David O first and um, Bonner Boy. <laughs> I would like to work with those guys and because they are big in the industry right now and um, you know I like to work with good things here. Yeah, let me just feel like that. Good things. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> so um uh you know if I'm not recording, you know, what I do for fun is probably cooking. <laughs> I love cooking a lot. You know, I can cook 
I can cook for you too if you want. I can cook a bono soup. I can cook um, um, a furry roll. I can cook some more. I can cook pound. <laughs> I can cook, sure. I can cook. I love cooking. Apart from music, I love cooking. I don't like going out like that. I just like staying in the... I would say it was when they called me to perform um, at Big Brother Ninja. Man, it was... I was actually sleeping that day. Oh, God. <laughs> and they just come. My mind just, uh, just eat me up like, yo, uh, we had to call... Uh, they said they wanted you in Big Brother. I said, what for? Performance. Oh, really? You know, it was like a shock. Just like... I wasn't prepared, like, it was that day, they just come like, yo, you just have to come through and oh, And we got there and we performed, people loved it. That day I trended, like, on Twitter for, like, two days, man. It's a classic, wow, boom, boom, man. I feel like a superstar that day. So it was, it was a boom for me that day. And I was grateful and I, feel, I felt blessed that day. Yeah, I'll say the global stuff. Because I have a deal coming up soon. Like, like international, like an international deal, but I don't want to let the car, like I don't want to say it, but like an international deal. So you guys should just watch out for T Classic 2020. Like it's going to be lit, super lit, super lit. Yeah. Go, Bojo.